started their own Airbnb, but have heard how everybody was making a ton of money and now all of a sudden there's an Airbnb bust. Well, I'm here to tell you about my personal experience because I started during the big bust. Let me, sh let me tell you about it. Let's start with the basics. How important it is to have a partner during a big investment like having a vacation home or Airbnb. The first is because she was there for the times of fear and when I would get discouraged. She would talk me up and encourage me to keep going. And it was really awesome because for whatever reason, during the times that I was discouraged, she was feeling really positive about the entire experience. And when she was feeling discouraged, I was feeling really positive about the experience. But let me give you a couple of examples. Like for one, when I had the first idea, and I knew I needed to make this leap of faith early in 2022, when apparently this big bust was starting to happen. Well, I had this leap of faith inside of me, and I knew that I needed to do this. But my significant other kept saying things like, you don't have the money, or you can't do it because you live 2,000 miles away, or it just isn't, you would tell me about how impossible it would be. And that kind of negativity, it gets into your mind and having somebody to talk that through with is really helpful. My partner and I would talk about these kind of lows that we both would be having at different times. And it would be really great because then we would try to figure out a plan around the, the negativity that we were having. Or we would talk about the worst case scenario. And you know what the worst case scenario is when you buy a vacation home? You sell your vacation home. Number two, spreading the workload. Spreading the workload is not even something that you think of because it makes it, all of these Airbnbers make it sound like it's really easy to have an Airbnb and you can automate it. But you know what? Doing the research to find the place is difficult. Then having to do all of the travel to the place to look at it and then having to furnish it. Man, I am so glad I had a partner so that we could split this up. And it is amazing because we both ended up loving different aspects of it. Like for example, she was all into the interior design and the furnishings. Whereas I thought it was really fun to make the budget plan and the business plan before we even opened it, before we even opened it as a vacation home. I thought that that was really cool. And now we've also found different things like she loves communicating with the guests a lot and making sure that they have little gifts. Like if it's their birthday, we have like a little gift card there for them. And she finds that to be really fun. Whereas I like doing the research. Um, for example, I watch the Rob Built channel and I can watch Kai Andrews and they kind of keep me in tune with like the changes that are happening in Airbnb. What are some good ideas? What are some not good ideas? Cause these are people that have come before me and they're able to really give me an idea of how to, how to keep going. The third is having someone there to talk about the good and the bad. Cause you know what, honestly, nobody cares about this journey except for the person you're doing it with. When I bought the vacation home, there was no one here to celebrate with because nobody really cared. But having a partner, we cared. We would toast Prosecco when we got our first booking or when we became a Airbnb super host. We've also found that when we're on this journey, having somebody to complain about some of the bad things too is really helpful as well. Nobody really cares about your problems. They kind of just glaze over and they like don't they can't understand it or they can't relate to it and they're just yeah like okay that sounds like it sucks and it's nice to actually have someone who can you can have a conversation with about that and encourage each other when you are coming and at the end of the day it has been really great having a journey to go with someone and all of the memories that have been made now we've had the airbnb vacation home open now for about six months and I gotta tell you, it's going great. We've had almost every single weekend book. There's only been two that have not during the bust of Airbnb. And we didn't have a thousand in reviews. In fact, we had zero. So just letting you know our experience has been great. And I think the very last thing to know about having a partner is to make sure that you have your goals aligned, that your vision is the same and your end goal is the same because that's really what it's about. And for us, financial freedom and creating generational wealth was the goal. Cheers till next time.